Are you crying? Are you being a little crybaby? Right, let me get the presents first. <gasps> Oof. Sit. Okay. Oh, I was gonna drop off your presents. And I was thinking Stella could have like a trial, I guess, <laughs> before she goes out in public. Merry Christmas. Thanks. <laughs> so these are so for heavy. here. One more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stella, don't get too excited. Is it too chihuahua? Oh, <laughs> no cute. No. Come on, over here. You're gonna see so many dogs right now. Wow, I'm surprised she's not excited. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stella saw chihuahua. You like a little chihuahua? Just a quick hi. I don't think she should get all crazy. Can you say hi? What the heck? She just made her way in. <laughs> She's like, I live here now. Look at her! <laughs> She's so excited! So I was like, okay, calm. <laughs> it's like Stella doesn't even know who she is. Do you say hi to Bella? Yeah. <laughs> oh no, it looks weird. This is the first time with the mask. Hi, what's up you guys? Welcome back to a walk and talk. Bethany's behind the camera. Uh, we came downtown so we can expose Stella to a more public setting. As you can see, she's, well, she looks fine now, but she was going super crazy right now. And I know she's not gonna walk great, but we're gonna expose her to this surrounding so she can get used to it gradually over time, you know? Oh, and also the lights for Christmas. So this is going to be like a Christmas edition. Yeah. Um, because downtown they have it all nicely decorated and you guys will see that right now. Stella. She doesn't even know what to do. <laughs> She's just like, whoa. So many things. These are the downtown lights. So many lights. Okay, let's go. I'm trying to get Stella. other dogs. Stella's never been in an environment like this. Yeah, this is completely new to her. She's always like in the area, like our neighborhood or like parks, but like never like outdoors like this. Last this time we did this, we brought my dog, Daisy, because she doesn't really like environments like this either, where there's a bunch of people. Yeah. But I think she did well. Yeah, she did really good. I mean, she barked at a few people, but she wasn't barking the whole time. Yeah. It was just when they tried petting her. The bikes. <laughs> bikes. That's why I have to stay next to But we have an announcement to make. Bella, Stella's daughter, is going to get pregnant soon. Yeah. It's going to be her first litter. How exciting. We went over to see the stud the other day. He was such a cutie pie. And I'll like insert some footage of him. Oh, this one. She like kind of got used to it. Yeah. Kind of. I'm pretty sure she'll calm down eventually. Yeah. JD was kind of like this when we got down at first. Yeah. No, not really. She was doing really good. You just couldn't see it because she's not a big dog. I guess. So she wasn't pulling. Yeah. But she was really hyper. We're gonna get a coffee at the coffee box. I feel like <laughs> Stella. The coffee box. The coffee box. Stella. Hey, Stella. <laughs> You're doing really good, actually. For a first time. I oh. heard it's really good, too, uh, not to let people, like, pet your dog in, like, open areas like this. Because uh -huh. it just, it's kind of telling your dog, like, it's oh, okay. it's okay for you to act out yeah. with all these people here. Yeah. But... Everyone is different, I mean. Like with their training, maybe not. But maybe when they're like used to it, yeah. then like they can. It's also harder because they're like a herding breed. And they want to like chase these like constantly. You're 
you're not meant for the city. I'm a country girl. We're gonna go to the crowd. Uh, we can go around. We can go straight. Hold on, I need to get her next to me. She's like going crazy right now. So, Jerry is coming next week. If you guys didn't know, he is driving as a trucker. So, he's like never here. Um, that's why he's not been in the videos lately. So yeah, he'll be here next week. We'll be making videos of him and Rocket. He's taking Rocket away from me. He is? Yeah. Hold on. No, no, stop. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm not even wearing my mask. So how's she doing? Horrible. <laughs> Just Stella. She's doing so so for her first time. Yeah. Ah, Stella. She's not all... doing absolutely terrible. We say that as she pulls me. <laughs> So I feel like she is really, like she wants the dogs for sure. With people, like it's not that bad. Yeah. The dog, she goes crazy if she's like there for the long time. Look at the Christmas tree. But it's huge, I swear. We're gonna go get some food for Beth. So we'll take you guys along. Careful with the scooters. There's so many scooters out here too. Yeah, I don't care. That's They're another like... thing. She's searching for a dog. Like, once she sees the dog, she goes crazy, but look, like, all these people, and she's fine. She's perfectly fine. Once she sees the dog, she goes so crazy. A psychopath. Stella, there's no dogs. You better settle down. Ew, you look like a psychopath. Why do you look like that? Why do you look like that? No! So I'm giving her some whipped cream, just cause. But she looks like a psychopath. This has been a ride. Should, if you want, yeah. So we're gonna end off the walk here. I wouldn't really call it a walk. I think it's more like getting her used to the conversation, the like the place, I guess. But after a while, she does come down, as you can see her. A lot of people. Oh, there's a dog. Oh my god. I did not notice there was a dog. Yeah, I did it. Yeah, so if you just saw, like she's still not good with dogs. Like she goes crazy. But like in general, there's not too many dogs here. It's not like a dog park or anything. Um, so with like people and stuff, like she's been doing really good. Um, and she actually relaxes to the point where like, like she's just there, you know, like see her. But besides all that, we're gonna end off the little walk thing. I hope you guys enjoyed. So thank you guys so much for watching. Me and Stella are going to go back home. I hope you guys enjoyed the lights and Stella walking and hopefully you guys learned a little something from the walk. I know I did. The more I take my dogs on a walk, the more I learn more about them. I feel like when you walk your dogs, you're gonna know the most about them because they act so much different than when they're at your house, when they're comfortable. There's so many obstacles that they have to go through while on a walk. And I was telling Bethany, I think while they're on a walk, um, especially since they're herding dogs, they're so stimulated that they want to just herd everything around them. So that's another obstacle that you have to maneuver with these dogs. Um, and that never crossed my mind. I obviously knew that they were herding dogs, but when I saw Stella constantly looking at people and dogs, it just reminded me that she is a herding dog and she's gonna wanna keep on going towards things like hurting them like it's in her nature kind of thing. So that's another thing I have to look out for at the end of the day. But thank you guys so much for watching once again. Happy holidays to all of you guys. I did say this was like a holiday related video. We kind of just strolled to our downtown area where they had a bunch of lights and Christmas decorations and everything. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, don't forget to leave a like so I know that you liked it and I can make more. I'm also going to be posting a lot more Christmas videos um, till Christmas actually arrives. So if you like this one, maybe you'll go ahead and like my other videos, Christmas related. If you guys want, subscribe to my channel. It's completely free and I have a bunch of videos about training or entertaining videos if you guys are more into that. But besides all that, thank you guys so much for watching once again and happy holidays. Bye!